All right, it was a sec. Worst joke of the night. Uh, I hate you. So we're gonna start again. So I hope everybody smoked right now. I know I do. Uh, next up, we have uh, Mark Winters. Uh, I don't know. He looks like a fucking faggot all the time. Mark Winters, everybody. Yeah. How's everybody doing? Fuck you. Are we all drunk enough to laugh at me yet? Always. Good. Thank you. Uh, first off, Chris, I did finger two of your ex-girlfriends. I would have done more if it was possible for you to get more than two girlfriends. The Canadian pen pal does not count. Nobody was buying that. Um... Speaking of these two fuckers, is it just me or did Guided by Voices get a whole lot fatter and... <laughs> oh no, I'm, I'm sorry. That's... They're called Wing and Tusk. I, I apologize for that. And you're not all fat, just you two. <laughs> Some of you are just big boned, um, and like maybe one or two are just drunk, which is good. It's a good health decision. You know, you just say, I don't need a fat ass, and you just stop with alcoholism. Which is a good health choice. I agree with that entirely. Um, Josh Ray is the lead singer. Um, Josh, I had a question for you. Hit me. Um, do they have a husky section in the Volunteers of America dumpster? <laughs> <laughs> or do you just like do a patchwork, like some like sinister hipster version of a Rumpelstiltskin character? <laughs> Josh Ray. Josh Just Coffee Ray. <laughs> Josh. Josh Personality Replacement Beard Ray. Josh Fuck Medicinal Yogurt Ray. <laughs> Did you know that every time that Josh belches, a unicorn is born? So thank you. You're doing the Lord's work. Honestly. It doesn't disgust any of us. Whatsoever. Um, but seriously, I'd like to address the uh, Rivari staff real quick. Thank you very much for letting us do this. Um, yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah, please. Just right there, come on. Uh, if there is any pizza that has fallen on the floor in the back of the Rivari room kitchen, uh, Josh Ray would be happy to take it. <laughs> Seriously, we need to get this man some floor pizza. <laughs> or poppers. He might take poppers. Josh, do you have any poppers in your beard? As a last resort? He doesn't have any poppers. Um, another member of the band, Chris Manis. Good man and thorough. <laughs> um, honestly, I gotta say, it... Uh, it works for you, so it's okay, but it looks like, to me, when I look at you, it looks like um, someone tried to make a second Josh Ray, and just like took it out of the Easy Bake Oven just a little bit too soon, and it didn't quite set. But you work it, it's cool. Um, but you should never go anywhere separately, because um, every time I see like either one of you alone, it feels like I'm like watching like just half of a circus act. Like a really terrible circus act I never even bought a ticket for. <laughs> um, Laugh at your own jokes. <laughs> um, but you're, you're a good man. Seriously. I love you. I'm going to say something about you um, that you've heard from women from, you know, for most of your life. And that is, I love you like a brother. <laughs> okay? Um, Roger Landis. How are you? Roger Landis is the gayest thing to come out of Columbus since Devo. Absolutely. I, got, I actually have to ask you a question as well. How many tattoos of dudes do you get to have on your body before we start asking questions? Because, like, I, is it just going to be... Like, one Thanksgiving, you're going to come with big news? <laughs> I 
And let me, uh, personally, and I think I speak for a lot of people, nobody here wants to give you another excuse to wear a wife beater. <laughs> I know what you're doing. I know what you're doing, just cut it out. But let's talk seriously for a second. Uh, Roger has been trying to be more healthy, which is good. Um, he's jogged, like, twice. Um, he's drinking diet soda now, which I had mixed feelings about at the beginning, but then I, I kind of came around to. Um, because if you start, like, doing that and then, like, ordering water with lemon and splitting entrees at restaurants, then I can just finally treat you like the doting aunt that I've always kind of thought of you as. <laughs> You're an asshole. <laughs> um, we can't forget Tyler, the man of the hour. Um, is Carlo here? Carlo Pitaluga. Carlo? Hey, do you like... Do you like Tyler? Do you like Tyler? I like I like Tyler too. I like his earlier stuff better. <laughs> <laughs> but that's just me. That's just me. A um, couple things about Tyler. Uh, he sews. Um, he cooks. And he sits down to pee. <laughs> So you can draw your own conclusions from that. Um, Tyler actually used to play soccer. Uh, he's still a fan. And when he played, he was pretty good. Um, he does not anymore, I think for academic reasons? <laughs> to work on your writing. <laughs> He doesn't anymore. But if anybody here thinks that that is the last time Tyler has encountered balls slapping against his legs, <laughs> you are sorely mistaken. You're forgetting the experimental years. Uh, Tyler usually frequented the truck stops. Not, not just truck stops. It was truck stops, air, airport bathrooms, um, abandoned marinas, <laughs> Whole Foods. <laughs> Um, they had a, uh, well, I, I mean, question for you as well, how did you do, like, the secret toe tap? Was that ever a challenge? Okay. Because I, I had always wondered that. They had a name for him, it was Truck Stop T-Bone. And he made quite a reputation for himself, um, because he can suck a mean cock, and he never has to kneel. No. He just has to back up and go forward. <laughs> you understand that, right? You're, you're like streamlined for cock sucking. <laughs> it's like a government agency made you to put my dick in your mouth. <laughs> that was um, that was a while ago, though. He's kind of settled down. Um, you know, it's not it's sowing wild oats, so to speak. I think he's kind of replaced that with Pokemon, um, as like a way to wean himself, which is kind of a wash when you get down to it, because there's a lot less chafing, but it's at least twice as gay, at the very least. And there's not chlamydia, unless it's a Pokemon. Is that a Pokemon? Chlamydia? I don't know. <laughs> Anyways. Tyler, I love you, even though you kiss like a Welshman. <laughs> and I would like everyone actually to raise their glass to this beautiful man right here, who's been such a good sport. You're here! Yeah. Yeah. Cheers to Tyler. Cheers. Happy birthday! Thanks. Thank you so much.